Yeah, it's going to be a big one. I know already the papers are on it and pumping it up. And uh, I suppose Collingwood, we have a few of those uh, throughout the year. And we had a big game against Geelong in, what, round nine, I think it was. So, yeah, this will be another another big game with a lot of uh, uh, focus on it from the out, from the footy world. And so that's exciting. Are you confident? Oh, yeah, definitely. I think um, our form line reads pretty similar to what it did when we came up against them in round nine. That round nine game, we had a lot of the play and were winning for a good part of that match. And uh, and as you know, Geelong are a quality side, and that's why they were over, able to overrun us uh, towards the end there. And we and they made us look flat to their credit. But um, no, there's no reason why we shouldn't be confident. We probably, if anything, our form line reads a little better than what it did last time round. Well, I think, and it will probably be the same for Geelong. Your your team's going to improve from round nine compared to round 19. That's just you improve as the season goes on, you tighten up your game plan. Uh, both of us are going to feature in finals, so we're obviously working towards tightening down a game plan that's going to hold up in finals. I think it's uh, it, it's four weeks away, and um, mathematically I think we're probably guaranteed a final, so we know we're going to be there, but it, it's just not worth focusing on at this stage. I think our main focus has to be week to week, as cliche as that sounds, that's the way we've got to approach it. Yeah, well, I think especially if Geelong and us can both field full-strength sides. Uh, it'll be an indicator, but it won't sort of be, be the be-all and end-all. Uh, it's still a long way off finals, even though it is only four weeks away. Uh, and so it'll be a good test, but it's, yeah, it's not going to phase us too much. Uh, I don't think heaps is on the line, because even if we were to drop this game, we'd still be, we'd be a chance at finishing top two. Like, there, there's not heaps on the line, I don't think. It's, it's another game. And I think Geelong are going to treat it that way too. We both know we're going to feature in finals and uh, obviously it'll be a nice edge to have over them if we do meet them again in September. But yeah, it, it's not that big a game, I don't think. Bruce, Bruce leg or something. Is that right? Yeah, I, I don't know what the diagnosis is. My understanding is that he'll train uh, and provided he gets through training, then yeah, he'll be in the mix. Uh, confident I can keep it, but by no means do I feel safe. It's, uh, we've got a number of good tools waiting in the twos to take my spot if my form drops drops much more and uh, and then the other part is we could go smaller and so a tall could fall out for a small and we've got quality smalls in the VFL as well. They, uh, I don't like to bring it up but uh, you were named as one of the sixth worst players at Collingwood. How does that make you feel to, to see your name in that list? <laughs> bottom, and bottom uh, six, bottom six, but they did use the term worst. Is that right? Yeah. yeah uh, harsh. Well, I haven't read it but um, no, look, that's probably fair enough. I'm one of the least experienced players. My form's probably been much more patchy than the others. I think I'm still in the team because I can play my role. And um, yeah, so that doesn't really phase me too much. What about at the level though? Mick was quoted earlier in the year saying you, he thought you were better than the VFL now. You're, you're ahead of that. Like do you, Just the yeah, league and, footy level. Yeah, and you'd, you'd hope that would be the case after this is my fourth year in the AFL. And I know they sort of harp on about big blokes taking longer, but in terms of my development, it was probably frustrating that I wasn't at the level last year. Uh, I'm, yeah, I think I'm capable of holding my spot in an AFL side. I'm, I'm sort of, I'm in there at the moment, uh, and so I'm, yeah, I'm comfortable. But that's what you'd expect of a fourth-year player, I think. We're just, uh, just going back a week. Was that a sort of a, a confidence-building win, or is that just another, another hurdle that you had to get? get through with Carlton yeah uh, I think it was an important win uh, definitely because they're a team that can be so good on they beat the Caps earlier in the year uh, and for us it was a matter of being able to really stifle them shut down their run and um, and if we can do that to a good team then it's going to be important for us and we'll take confidence from that